In Long Beach, it all comes down to what you look like. It's all about color. If you're Latino or Asian or black. For most of us, high school is not easy to get through, especially for the students at Wilson High in the film Freedom Riders, who also had the burden of being caught up in gang warfare. Academy Award winner Hilary Swank, who is often attracted to true stories based on passionate people, talks about how she portrayed Erin Gruel, the real educator in the story. It wasn't for me getting any ma mannerisms down necessarily, it was just finding the passion behind her to, so get, to get that across um, and her love for the kids and, you know, so more than physical, it was a, a mental thing that I was trying to capture and Richard, our, our writer-director, had written it so eloquently in, in a way that just all I needed to do was really say the words. Most of the students in Freedom Riders were written off by the education system, but luckily they had a special teacher who believed in them, encouraging them to rise up out of their low self-esteem to attain higher knowledge. Three, two, one. Aaron is certainly, in my eyes, a hero. And I know in, a, in her kids' eyes, she's quite a hero too because she's changed their lives. And, um, that person's turn is over. It's amazing to me how one person can make the difference. Um, just that one, just Everyone one person can change an event in a person's life and change their life forever. Freedom Riders also stars Patrick Dempsey as Hillary's husband. You can also see Hillary in another true life story, Boys Don't Cry, well, making its debut on Lifetime Television this, this weekend. Then I heard gunshots. She told us we had something to say to people.